if you're ready to export, you'll need to save. So like, let's say I have brought this project in and maybe I wanna add a new track, make some changes to it. So I might want to, maybe I wanna chop this up and take out this section right here or maybe I wanna add a loop to it. Whatever I'm doing, whatever my work is that I'm doing, I can do all that work. And then when I'm ready to now export this again, I can hit save. And then you'll notice this right here, this download button is gonna change and it's gonna say mixing. So Soundtrap is in the background, going to do some audio magic to mix and master this project and create an MP3 uh, that you can then download. So it usually takes a minute or two to do that. Uh, and then you'll be able to click this button. So now it's done mixing and I can click this button and that will download my file. For me, it's downloading as a WAV, but you can always come in here and you can say export and you can choose an MP3 file if you would prefer that. And there's one other way you can do it. If for some reason you wanna export just one track and not the whole entire thing, you can do that. So I can go to this track, click these three buttons and I can export that track and then that will just export only this track right here. So if you want to download the whole thing, the final product, you download with this button. Uh, and if you want to just download a certain track, you can go to that track and then choose your export option from here. And that's it. That's how you can import and export audio.